Hey Raven fans, welcome to Raven Roundup Fedora Edition. I'm CJ Vredenberg alongside Jake Hurl. Today we have updates on state tennis plus soccer, football, volleyball, and cross country. This weekend, the Ravens sent two double pairs to Wichita for the state tennis tournament. Chris and Knipp, Mallory Brown, Kaylee Kaplman, and Nikki Hoffey all participated with Chris and Knipp and Mallory Brown becoming the first Ravens to medal in tennis since 2009. Way to go, ladies. The Ravens soccer team was in action Thursday night at Lauren High School. The squad took over the match with Brock Baker scoring a goal, alongside Chase Klusman and Braden Beard scoring two apiece. The Ravens improved to two wins, ten wins, no losses, and two ties. Tomorrow night they will head to Shawnee Mission East to compete for the first Sunflower League boys soccer title in school history. Last Thursday night was a busy night for the Ravens as the football team traveled to ODAC to face off against the Latham North. It was a tough night for the Ravens with the Eagles keeping Northwest off the scoreboard for the entirety of the game. Latham North scored three touchdowns on their senior night and would eventually win the game 21-0. This loss takes the team to 2-5. This week, the Ravens travel to Shawnee Mission South to take on the Raiders. On Saturday, the volleyball team hosted the O&W Invitational, with teams from all around the area coming to play. The Ravens beat Blue Valley Southwest, Olathe East, Olathe South, Shawnee Mission South, and Olathe North each in two sets for a total of five wins on the day. Last Friday, the cross-country team participated in the Sunflower League Championships at Rimrock Farm. Olathe Northwest took 13th overall, and Bradley Davis finished in the top 70. That's all we have for you today. Tune in next Monday for a new edition of Raven Roundup. Have a great day, Ravens.